this is Justin Flugum from Additive Guru, and today we're going to be talking about a print failure related to poor adhesion to the bed and leaving it on for a long period of time and what happens if you don't watch it. So ultimately this failed because it didn't stick to the bed. What ended up happening is it kept running for probably about an hour or two, and when it was running it was just balling up into a ball which ends up leaving it in a mess inside our chamber here of the nozzle area. The best way to fix this is to heat it up. I've got it about 230 right now. And if you don't heat it up, it won't come off at all because it's pretty much hardened on there. But once you've got it heated up, you can take off the shroud that holds your fan, specifically on the under three. And then it should pull off about any major issues. If it does not, then we'll work on changing to a heat gun. The next step would be a heat gun if it does not release with what we've got the temperature set at 230. But just pull the fan off and as you can see it's a gob mess. I should be able to just yank on it and all of it should just fall right off. As you can see it's a steaming pile of goo. And it will stink. But you got to get in there and try to get all of it out while you're at it. You don't want to leave any behind. And as you can see, it's smoking. Once we get all of this off, we'll take and scrape off what we can't get with the pliers. But you definitely don't want to touch it. You want to keep your fingers away from it as much as you can because it is really hot. And it sticks to you pretty good too. Alright, that pretty much will clean off that. Go down and prepare it to cool down. Scrape off any little residue excess we can get. And that should do it. We'll put our shroud back on. And that will pretty much finish that. Now for poor bed adhesion, the best fix is to either clean your bed with isopropyl alcohol as best as you can, get your bed as level as you can get it, and if not, worst case scenario, get out a glue stick or get a new bed surface. And put on the last screw. And that'll finish it. 